Willkommen Freunde zurück bei Life is Strange. Ihr erinnert euch an die Frage vom letzten Part? Was ist passiert? Tja, gute Frage. Jetzt nur die Frage, soll sie zur Polizei gehen oder nach Beweisen suchen? Ich habe keine Ahnung. Ich drücke jetzt einfach... <lacht> ich meine... Sie kann zur Polizei gehen, okay. Aber der Typ ist ja eh so stink... Was braucht der denn so reich, was die Eltern eh immer alles... Komm. If you do that, they won't believe you. You're on video grabbing at all those guys and they'll use that against you. Bad. But I know I was drugged. That's what you have to prove, not them. I'm just telling you how the cops in school will look at this. The video doesn't exactly back you up. You make me feel so hopeless. No, no, Kate. I just don't want you to get hurt anymore. That seems impossible at this point. So that's your answer? I, I think we should wait. There are other things going on that might help you. But not right now. So I can walk down the halls with people calling me a viral slut. Thanks, Max. Oops. Äh, ich spule mal zurück, mal gucken, was passiert, wenn wir sagen, sie sollte zur Polizei gehen. Warte mal. Good job, Dr. Max. She didn't like what I had to say, but we need more proof of what happened. So, wir legen noch was Buch ab. So Max, can I ask you a question? Das And please. Wir mal eben. Geh zur Polizei. Yes, you should definitely go to the police, Kate. I totally believe every word you say. Nathan Prescott is truly dangerous. Bless you, Max. I will go to the police. And also Principal Wells. With you as my backup witness, they'll have to take us seriously now. Backup witness? Well, I mean, I believe you in everything, but we're still just spoiled punk students to the cops and faculty. I just think we need to be very careful here. Why? Careful of what? Nothing. Except the Prescotts are a powerful family. That's my auntie, I hope this won't backfire on us, that's all. Even though that rich bastard has earned some serious bad karma. He'll get it. Ist alles scheiße im Moment. Wir gehen dann mal. Mal gucken, was sie jetzt sagt. Time out, Max. You actually told Kate to go to the police and the principal. After getting a scary text threat. Now the police will definitely drag you into this shit. Ja, Pech. Wir müssen zum... Sonst ist nichts hier. Falsche Taste, Entschuldigung. Die wollte ich. Ich will hier raus. Na, schau mal, wer da auf uns wartet. Das Gerüst ist weg, okay. Hi Taylor. Hi Taylor. Just because you were nice to Victoria doesn't mean I have to be nice to you. Well, sorry to exist, Taylor. On that we agree. Do you mind? Leaving? Thanks. Meine Güte. Max, come on over here. Hi. 
What are you doing here? Oh, nothing. Waiting for a call? I mean, I already took the call. Anyway, I wanted to rap about that action yesterday. By the way, thank you for stepping in. You were pretty badass, Warren. I owe you. Oh, yes you do. I got knocked on my ass by that dick. I'm some personal superhero. You're a real everyday hero. You stood up to a bully and it was awesome. Even though you left me with said bully and ran off with that girl, she's pretty punk rock. How do you know her? An old friend, Chloe Price. We haven't seen each other in a while. I bet you were glad to see her blast up in that truck like a rock star. Which begs the question, why is Nathan Prescott getting psycho on you? I busted him in the bathroom yesterday with a gun. I was too scared to tell Principal Wells. Please, don't say anything. I'll give you more info later. You're fucking weak. Like that bizarro snowfall yesterday? Speaking of dystopia, that drive-in is having a 70s Planet of the Apes marathon. Let's go ape! Warum nicht? Yes, that's exactly what I need. I love those old school ape films. Well, that was easier than I thought. Cool, I'll text you the info. Warum nicht? Aber <coughs> jetzt müssen wir erstmal zum Diner oder wo mussten wir hin? Ich glaube ja. Oh ne, steht der Kerl schon wieder. David talking to Nathan cannot be a good thing. This has something to do with Kate. Or Rachel. Das ist der Bus. Ich wollte gerade sagen, von hinten hat er gerade irgendwie eine andere Visur, aber das, da saß noch ein. Da saß noch ein Typ dahinter. Oh ne, komm, nicht Musik, ey. Das mag ich nicht. Das mag ich nicht. Ich muss echt aufpassen, ey. Ach, ich wollte gerade sagen, wie lange sie nicht anfangen zu singen. Soll das alles kein Problem sein, aber... Ah... Ja, wird schon. Irgendwie wird das schon. Ja, die guten amerikanischen Busse. Hm. Nicht einschlafen. Nicht einschlafen. Kommt da hoch. Wo ist das deiner? Wenn wir so lange fahren. Dann ist der Leuchtturm. Ah, ich glaube, wir sind da. Das sieht doch ganz gut aus. Möwen. Ui. Ex Black Wall Transport. Okay. Don't try to take it from me. It's mine. I wouldn't dream of it. I'm gonna be a millionaire. Hope nobody steals my lottery. Talk about going back in time. The diner looks exactly the same. <laughs> Can I just look at him? Dem könnten wir reden. Was ist das? Hi. Good morning. Looks like you're ready to catch some serious fish. I wish, young gal. Arcadia Bay just isn't the same fishing town I grew up in. Has the town changed much? By Neptune's beard, it has. Seems like a lifetime ago when I was king of the harbor.
You have your own boat? I call her the Bali High. I've kept a hold of her in these lean days. Might be all the time we've got left. I thought one of Arcadia Bay's main exports was fish. Oh, the fish used to jump onto my boat. Until the Prescotts and their finance fiends snapped up harbor rights. Vida. The Prescotts have a lot of power. They might rename the town Prescott Bay, if that tells you much. Do you know them? Do good for my working kind. I know them through their bad deeds. Let's not get downcast. I hear the fish calling for Bali High. Never forget that old fishermen never die. We just smell that way. I'd love to learn more, but I have to get going. Happy fishing out there. Yeah. Look at all these flyers. It's so sad that nobody will read them. Uh, yeah, okay. Sehr witzig. Ups, anders rumdrehen. Smell of breakfast and the sound of clanging silverware oh, makes me feel 13 again. Komische Frau. Hallo. Hello there to you. Such a beautiful day, eh? Oh yeah, it's gonna be a super day. Enjoy your breakfast, eh? Okay, sie ist wirklich komisch. What do you want? I feel like shit. Too much beer, so spare me, please. Just let me suffer quietly. Ah, oh, so good. Hello, sir. Hi, young lady. You look a little lost. Nine? No, I've been here many times. It's like a fourth home. <laughs> I wish I could make the two whales my first home. Joyce making rocket coffee and juicy burgers at a time? Mm. <laughs> you look about Chloe's age. So, you know Chloe? Sadly, we all know Chloe down at the station. <sighs> Poor Joyce. Just heard she even just got busted with pot in her room. Uh, that's not good. Anyway, mm, that bacon sure smells good. Is she a friend of yours? I know her. Then you know she's a handful. Mrs. Uh, she can be, but she can also be a good friend who shows up when you need her. Sounds like you're a good friend. I wish she would be a great daughter and not cause Joy so much stress. How well do you know Joyce? I know her delicious grub. Everybody at the station comes here. We take care of this place like it's our own kitchen. And Joyce, like she's our... our mother. I guess you're friends with David Madsen. I wouldn't use that word. We know each other. Why do you ask? Just curious. I'm surprised he's not a police officer in Arcadia Bay. I have respect for David. He served his country. He found his calling at Blackwell. At the station, we're happy David is exactly where he is. <laughs> Not everybody can be a cop. I have to go now. Enjoy your breakfast. By the way, one thing I can tell you for certain is to stay away from that RV outside. I usually stay away from sketchy parked vehicles. Wise policy. The guy who lives in it, Frank, is pretty sketchy himself. That's all I can say for now. I should finish up my coffee and get to work. Yeah, thank you. I don't feel like talking right now. Okay. I gotta deliver a load of breakfast to my stomach. Over now. Drool. Want everything.
forgot about the fishing wall of fame. Ich frag mich gerade, wo die wo sie ist, egal. Äh, weißer Stör, ja. Wo ist die denn? Ich dachte, wir sollten uns hier treffen. Coming up at noon, K-Bay 7 News will explore the mystery of yesterday's unusual snowfall on a warm and sunny late afternoon that confused and delighted Arcadia Bay residents. We'll be talking with Portland meteorologists in the area and look at some of your fun video reactions to the odd snow flurry. Who knows? Maybe Mother Nature was pranking us all. So, stay tuned to K-Bay 7 News for the real story. Uh, nah. Ja, mal gucken, ob was irgend auch so vermisst. Gross. That graffiti has been here forever. Können Foto machen. Komprimiert. Liste. Ja, irgendwo. Wir können noch ein Foto von draußen irgendwie machen. Müssen wir mal gucken. Aber wo ist die denn? Ich dachte, wir sollten uns hier treffen, nur bin ich im. So, Foto. Bling. I. Prozessor. Ja, was ist das? Hier steht einer. A man. Hi. Excuse me, sir. Can you believe this town? The world is on fire, and our big headline is snow. I can hardly wait for next week's big story. Clouds! The snow was pretty odd. It was right in the middle of a warm, sunny day. Oh, global warming bullshit. It's the Northwest. Snow happens. I keep reading how Arcadia Bay is booming. The paper can only talk about that. Or about missing girls. This town is more like a mystery to me. You're young. You'll get over it. An obdachloser. Hallöchen. Hi. Hello. Oh, look at you. A fine example of youth. I bet you're a senior student. Yes, I go to Blackwell Academy. I could tell you're a wise young woman. I know all about Blackwell and this town. How long have you lived in Arcadia Bay? A thousand years. I've gone through the same changes as the town. Uh -huh. What happened to you? What didn't happen to me? Sometimes you start out in life turned around the wrong way. I married dumb, made mistakes, got cheated out of my savings, lost my home, and now I hang out here. I'm sorry. Have you ever lived outside of here? Where the hell would I go? I hate the sun and love the mist. I might be homeless, but Arcadia Bay is still my home. You must know Joyce Price from the Two Whales Diner. She's fed me more than my own family. How's a daughter your age who's always in trouble? Married to a real prick. His name is David Madsen. He told me to get a job once, asshole. Not sure what Joyce sees in him, but he better treat her right. 
Hmm? I bet you have dirt on the Prescott family. That whole family is dirty. They once done good things for Arcadia Bay. Those days are dead. Like anything in their way. I know somebody who's being threatened by a Prescott. Then you be their guardian angel, because nothing gets in the way of that family, especially not the law. Hell, they own your school, Blackwell. Almost. I have to go now. Goodbye. Oh, huh. Okay. Foto vom Hund. Er sagte, doch wir sollten uns mit ihrem Diner treffen, aber irgendwie funktioniert das nicht. Na naja, egal, Freunde, ich würde mal sagen, das war's für heute. Wir machen beim nächsten Mal hier weiter. I don't want to go that way. Und ich würde erst mal sagen, bis dahin und ciao.